Are you guys quite done? Welcome back to Seven Shades of Shouting Hammerites and the Hammerite Imperium. Um, I had intended to go straight up this go and went left to head down to the right there. Towards the generator room. We'll just wait for this next pass. He'll, he'll be back soon. Hopefully there's nobody in the generator room or this could be a really short trip. Here he comes, and there he goes. Right. Uh, I did not expect fancy floors in a generator room. Ouch, guys. Shall come to see thee on the wings of mine iron mace. Oh, he's got a fucking lamp. Thou shalt die in the shall perish by my hand, O foe. Thou cannot avoid thy eyes, for thou shalt die in the name of the Grand Theram Order. Well, this is not going too well, is it? I can't use the mine because I have to arm it. The villain shall yeah. fall! Thou come to see thee, thou on the wings of mine iron mace. mace for long, yeah. shall come to see thee, on the wings of mine iron the mace. The villain shall fall! Ha ha ha! The villain shall thou fall! Die! Thou shalt shall fall before the builder's might! Thou shalt die in the name of the Grand Theram Order! Death shall come to see thee, on the wings of mine iron mace! <laughs> Thou shalt die in the shall fall. Oh, wow, they got distracted pretty quickly by, by the red guy. Okay. I mean... Oh wow! By the builder's hand. Ah! They're not invincible after all. Death shall come to see Hammers, die. hammers work. Fall before the builder's might. Wow! Go die. team Red. Go thou team Red. Fall before the builder's might. The villain shall fall. Well, I was not expecting that level of. Uh, I thought they were right when they said invincible. I guess invincible to Team White. Well, I mean, that is too. Smitten by the builder's hand, oh foe. That is too all. Two silvers down, two reds down. So it's not a red victory per se, but something pre pretty good by. Uh... So he's going to be yelling that all the time now. Thou shalt be smitten by the builder's hand, O foe! Well, I do want to move the bodies away from the stairway, because I need to go down the stairway, but maybe I shouldn't touch any of them. Art thou ready to die? I didn't see if those silver guys had any money on them, that's a... So he's going to see this body here and get alerted again, the right? Villain shall fall. No, I guess not. 
Maybe because it's not one that I'm responsible for. Alright, well. I guess that went okay. I guess having two silvers out of the way is not... It's not actually a problem for me, and it wasn't... You know, it's, it's a silver and red team skirmishing. I didn't really have much to do with it except running away. However, what I was hoping is that I would come down here to the generator room and find like a generator that was powered off or some or a switch that was disconnected for controlling the elevator upstairs. So that I could turn it on and have the elevator going and that does not seem to be the case. So I don't know why I can't run the elevator. The other thing I definitely expected before coming down here was that we'd be getting into purple long before coming to silver or... ...before uh, running into uh, silver or black territory. Um, oh, well, the stairwell to lower level is this eastern passage. Okay, so I don't want to go east. Not yet. Oh, oh. Oh. Well, we found the excavations, I guess. <laughs> Interesting, that's actually marked here as a hole. That's not a laboratory down there. This is the laboratory. Uh, if we tried to get down there, that's a one-way trip. I don't know. I don't know about that. But where's this singing fellow? Mold out course of rivers and bring its change to the face of the earth. There is a disturbance in the air. I feel it in my veins. The metal sinks. Okay, what's this, what's this tell us? Greetings, Silver Team Leader Michaela, son of City Statesman Zeliver, first citizen of Krom. I wish to take this opportunity to inform thee of some delicious tactics for thy team and deliver to thee the weapons that thy team shall use to gain the advantage and victory. Arm thy team's archers with the gas arrows provided. They should serve thee well against any attack, direct or distant. As for fights, thou hast the light metal maces, enough to pummel the spirits from the opposition. Thou needest thank me not for the metallic suits nor gas masks. Tis my pleasure to see thee wear them with pride for the glory of the firm order. They'll make thee and thy team members impervious to gas or knockout attacks. As well, the suits are armed with small flashlights to see the enemy even in the darkest of shadows. The flash bombs thou shouldst as well find most useful. Try not to blind thyself though whilst using them. Use thine engineers to fill the cathedral basement with various traps against any enemy attacks. Coordinate with thee, each with the other that thou do not run into thine own traps. The protectorate watches can be most detrimental to the games, as I am certain thou knowest well. As such, I have given them a small incentive to turn their eyes away. I trust thou wilt not be blubbering about our secret weapons after the games. Luck be yours in the games, my son of metal. Long live the firm order. Second firm high counselor, Valtero. Flash bombs, okay. Well, these guys should not be immune to flash bombs, even if I can't knock them out afterwards. I can at least flash bomb them and run away, right? Month of St. Gregorius. 22nd, decided to test the new FDA-33X generator on maximum power for my thesis. The output is incredible. Going to make the test run as long as I can. 23rd, uh, the generator is overheating. I've tried to stop the reaction, but it just won't shut off. I'm going to adjust the cooling pipes. 24th, blasted generator is still overheating. 25th, today the generator exploded and blew a massive hole into the catacombs. Oh, builder, I lost my eyebrows and hair. I dearly hope that I won't get expelled for this. I'm going to have to rename my thesis to why the FDA-33X generator is unsafe for use and effects of FD radiation on humans. Well, that explains the hole, I suppose. Hello. <coughs> oh yeah, the effects of FD radiation is not good. I wonder if some bread will uh, is enough to heal that. Or sausages? Mm. No, sausages have no effect. 
Bread though, bread, bread does counteract. Bread and cabbage. There's more, uh, more for your thesis. How am I going to get back there? I'm just going to spinning back and forth rapidly, right? Thou noticed something move over there in the treacherous darkness. I guess I can get past pretty quickly. What's he guarding? There is a disturbance in the air. He's guarding the northern passage. So, oh, he's the guy guarding the other stairs. I see. That's fine. Oh god, we've got these, these guys everywhere. Patrolling to and from. Mold that force of rivers and bring a change to the face of the earth that he shall be master of all. So, somewhere map it all storage. Alright, let's go to the storage room. about using one of these for the moment. Doesn't seem to be anything of value in this room now. They're not even storing anything. What do you mean storage? It's storing empty space. Maybe it's just air as a component for the gas arrows, right? I think he just goes in and out. Nope, he comes around here. Not too close there. The builder is the architect. It is his plan to which we pay homage. Our works are his children. God, these guys have such As terrible songs. I am absolutely convinced I need to quit the hammer right. I order after this. I should not try and win this. Do I really want to be one of these boring people? No. I should become a thief instead. The sneaking around, stealing things is so much more exciting. has a noisy floor and does not seem to have anything else of value in it. Oh, maybe, maybe there's something over there. I do feel I need to wait for this guy to go, come in and go around there. He doesn't see me. It's a little too much light in this corner for my liking, but as long as he doesn't come very close, it should be okay. Identified man in the building. I fear that he might be a thief. We shall find and terminate his foolish soul. Mold out ports of rivers and bring a change to the face of the earth that he shall be master of all. Alright, is so there nothing else in here? Big stained glass illustration. Um, Alright, we should go into the main chapel. There's at least two people in there. 
I guess we'll want to follow this guy out again, I think. That's the safest approach. Given the amount of light in this room. Hello, yeah, truck safety, right? Let's just go for it. No, oh, this is fucking noisy. Alright, we're gonna have to spend quite a lot of water here, I think. don't know how twitchy these guys are. How much they'll react to a water arrow hitting near them. Let's get all four lights. Now we can just sort of creep around him. Oh, not all of them have gas proof helmets. Okay, then these ones just breathing apparatus, I think. They've got gas arrows, apparently. The builder said, Go out into the land and build mighty fortresses that you might cleanse it the land. Guide the unbeliever with my wisdom. And steal all the gold of my. What do you call it? Altar. Okay, where do these guys hang on? Where do these guys keep their? They're like the lower level is black. Where do these guys keep their? Uh... Oh, maybe the icon fell with the lab down down there. I mean, what is what is their icon? It's a gear. Thou shalt tame the trees and stones. Well, it's not here, that's for sure. In all things, to walk upon the water, but where do they keep their icon? And wind and cold of winter. I don't know. I fear that he might be a thief. We shall find and terminate his foolish soul. Terminate the soul. It's an interesting turn of phrase. Wait a minute, the other question I just haven't been, I haven't been paying attention to these guys' belts, right? Oh, there's the gear, he's got it on his fucking belt, okay. That's what I suddenly realised, that like, maybe, maybe I need to pickpocket it off somebody. Okay, we can do this. We can creep across this floor again. Oh, shut up, guys. Shut up. Oh, my God. Please, terminate my soul. Save me from this constant singing. Alright, silver team, you lose. Can't even think with all the singing. Build 
All right. my wisdom, and if he will not be guided, then blind him, that he may more willingly see my Let's see which way this guy's facing. Mold thou courts of rivers and bring it change to the face of the earth that he shall be master of all. Okay, so that's the generator room. So we could go down, we could maybe go down the lab. So there's a, there's a thing. The catacombs. Well, the catacombs are black level, right? Presumably that's just going down. Well, to there? To this foundation area? Hmm, not sure. I don't see any loot here. Where's the other set of footsteps I'm hearing? There. That's a long way down. That is for sure. And does this get turned at all, or is he constantly facing this way? Because I might have to use some more water if he's constantly facing this. So I mean, I've still got, what, 16? Still got... An amazing number of water arrows, so it's not really a gonna be a great loss to say let's let's put out that torch there. The builder said, Go out into the land, build mighty fortresses that you might land at the land. Where am I hearing this? Guide the unbeliever with my wisdom. Voice from. And if he will not be guided, oh, there. then blind him, that he may more willingly see my truth. The face of the earth, that he shall be master of all. Oh, that guy's patrolling around this, line, this side as well. Hmm. I'm gonna need to hit that torch. Am I gonna be safe here? I don't know. The builder said, Go out into the land, build mighty fortresses that you might cleanse at the land. Guide the unbeliever with my wisdom. And if he will not be guided, then blind him, that he may more be unbeliever with my wisdom. And if he will not be guided, then blind him, that he may more willing to see my Okay, this guy down here, I think, has a purse on his belt. No, I thought I saw a purse, but I guess I did not. Be too profitable with them. This black team are going to be a problem, right? If I. Well, I guess that works. Oh, I see something possibly valuable there. I'm gonna leave my uh, there is an unidentified man in the building. 
I'll leave my rope there as a tool for escaping, I think. Oh shit, this guy's coming back. Oh, there's, there's loot up here too. Bang. I'm gonna need every bit of loot I can get. Alright, well, see what this guy was guarding first. Oh, some kind of crypt. Wow, this place looks familiar. Very bone hoardy. wonder if it's got the same traps. In fact, it is exactly this place from the bone hoard. Except with people, not the haunts. On the bottom. Yeah, even with the coffin, with the golden bones. Huh. I mean, slightly fancier textures, but uh, that's kind of fun. And that looks like a, a collapse over there. I'm not sure. A crack, crack in the wall. Oh, so he doesn't actually come in here. I don't remember what that room should be. So I don't want to step on any of that, right? That's got to be all pressure plates. We know, we know from Bone Horde that's a trap. It's got to still be a trap here for sure. What about this? I'm going to need to risk the floor. Is this corpse? The <clears throat> well, let's not worry about that just yet. We've got loot first. But hey, we opened a new passage to somewhere. There is a disturbance in the air. I feel it in my veins. The metal. All right, he's going back to his patrol. That's okay. There is a I'm gonna go back up. For a very specific reason, is this loot I need to get back on that place. We're gonna to need to come back here. We're gonna to need to follow this guy back. Where is he going? There he comes. There is an unidentified man in the building. I fear that he might be a thief. We shall find and terminate his fool. So that's a, that's a line they really should have redone, because, I mean, they did all these voice lines just for this, but I fear he may be a thief. It's like, I no. I fear he may be from... You know, they could say Team Red or something. Gotta be black zone, right? 
tea for wisdom. Greetings, my lord. Oh, why is Illustera, most righteous black team leader? I'm nervous. Yes, that's it, nervous. About the games, I mean. I can't ask the others. They are too busy making preparations. They will not help. This I know. But you. I've heard much about you. You, a great, nearly flawless leader. I just thought, maybe, that is, if you would not mind, if you'd give me a little help. Mind you, I'm not asking you to physically help me win the games. Oh no, certainly not. I merely wonder if a tactician of your great experience might perhaps be willing to grant one such as myself a few helpful insights into the tactics of warfare, even if they are only war games. You can no doubt surmise from observation I am no commander, and certainly not when it comes to war. Your help in this matter would leave me in your debt, sire. As agreed, Ixis will place a little down payment for some repairs to be delivered to the sewers. Most humbly, Alarenzi, Blue Team Leader. Well, I'm hearing footsteps on the right there. Okay, they've receded again. Ah, that's black team. Okay. They do go fully invisible in the dark. Oh, they make very strange noises. Right, we shall have to be very careful of them down here, but we're not doing this just yet. Any more food? No healing potions, of course. Not terminate his foolish soul. And the holy chisel. Thou shalt tame the trees and stones to do thy bidding in all things. Walk upon the waters of we hold of winter. I'll just take that, thank you. And check this floor as well. I don't think I looked thoroughly. Alright, I mean, if there's more, I'm not going to start jumping to, to get the rest, if, this, if jumping would be needed. Go, she comes this way. Oh my god, are these guys just ever stop singing? Of course not.
Where, where am I going now? Oh yeah, down into the... Down here. Not going straight to black zone yet. We have this thing reopened. He was super efficient, like, it's just like, if I wasn't looking at him, he was not moving. Let's wait till his back is turned. Actually, you know what? Mm, no, I'll just creep it. No, I'll put moss in this bright bit, so we can move fast over the bright bit. See the passage that goes any goes anywhere interesting that way, but here we have a lava pit, I mean, which certainly is interesting, but also why? Well, there's a weird window that overlooks it. Hmm. There's something up. Something is up with this place, but I don't know what. That's a nice touch. They've got a uh, big reflections. Oh, it's Mars. I thought there was something to pick up. <laughs> what do we have here, though? Nuggets? Valuable nuggets. Is that a tripwire? It does look rather tripwire-ish to me. I almost walked into. Can I even get around that above? What's what's the height is it? Hmm. And there's another one beyond it. I wish I had two beyond it. I guess I can try going up here. Oh no, maybe it's just spiderwebs. Maybe it's just supposed to be spiderwebs. Not tripwires. Couldn't see any sign of traps, hello. I mean, this is a trap, right? They're gonna spawn some shit on me. But from where? Let's make sure we're quiet at any rate. Not a trap. How is that not a trap? How do you do that as a level designer and not make it a trap? How do you have that such a strain? All right, we're gonna maybe these other threads were traps, were actually traps. I might have just walked through some. I don't know. Let's just leave well enough alone, I suppose. All right, so that's all. This isn't gonna get us into the black side. <laughs> It's just giving us... The what's up? What is up with this lava room? That's the question. What is up with the lava room? I don't know. <laughs> okay. So we're at the... Eastern end, right? We're in the mausoleum.
Lava room definitely has something up with it. And if he will not be so he's sponsored by the Imperial Protectorate, yeah. Guided, then blind him that he may more willingly see my truth. Right, so we need to follow this guy back again. Wait for him to come. Wait, let's go this side. Is there anything up with this? There is a cavern behind there, actually. This crack reveals a hole, not. Is there a secret door somewhere on here? Hmm. Wait, there's definitely, there's definitely parallaxing going on there. I mean, maybe that's just not meant to be revealing a secret, but... I don't know. My instincts say secret. But the evidence does not seem to support that theory. The builder said, Go out into the land and build mighty fortresses. But if I watch this guy carefully, maybe I'll see his light light up some wall differently. Revealing a secret, perhaps, but. Also, perhaps not. Okay, black. We have a map, right? North of Nottum, south of the Chalice. I saw someone moving over there. The builder said, Hearken unto me. So here's where I need light to be able to see the enemies. That's of course they need light to be able to see me. Right, these guys are coming. I guess we can hear them. I guess we're going to the north tombs. Oh. They just stopped there. Maybe we follow this guy instead. I mean, I like their choice of music, but you really should have headphones that don't leak so much.
Can you wait? God, he is barely... Oh, he is patrolling around. Why don't you fall in the pool and drown yourself, man? I'm gonna have to quick save quick Oh! I mean, I... Didn't mean it. Well, okay. I'm glad you took my advice, I suppose. So there's other ways to go down this. A very nice use of that mask object, actually. Scale it up to ridiculous levels. And use it as a waterfall. Hello, where's that light up? Here are the theaters your minds as per our agreement. I'm sorry, but these are very expensive, so sadly I cannot provide you with more. These will aid your team against the silvers. Yes, yes, yes. We already know this information. So we just got nine more Theodosian Mines and Power Nodes. Okay. I can't even see his body, it's dark, too dark down here. Where did he pull in? This side. <laughs> Doesn't have any loot on him? No, okay, then, then he might as well stay down there. Oh, is this, uh... Oh, it's going lower, okay. Interesting, I don't think that opens. I wouldn't be able to fit down there, even if it did. But where the water's pouring in here, it must be coming in from the river above, right? Okay. So this is the... Is this the North Tombs? No, we're on the southeast side. It's a chalice room. Statue Hall has another room off it, is probably where they're keeping their thing. Now, how would I tell if there's anybody waiting in the darkness here? Listening, I suppose. I heard footsteps there. I don't know if they're coming here. I don't know where they're coming. If they were to come down this hallway, I need to be on this side so I don't get spotted as I run through the pool of light. So I need to give us a little bit of time. If they're just going around the statue hall, then that's fine. I might not see them. I think I just heard the footsteps go past the entrance. Turns out... Being able to go fully invisible is quite, quite a powerful uh, ability. Let me 
Let's see if we're confident no one comes down this hall. Oh, there's two of them walking by. I just barely saw them. They turned left. There they are. Make sure they're not going to catch me in here. <laughs> and let's read their plans. Most righteous leader of the Black Legion, Elistera. Under the approval of the Black Hand Brotherhood, I have acquired the Precursor Fessim Illinatrium device for thee. I trust thou canst find a good use for it in the games. Forget not that, with its power, the light canst hide just as well as the shadows. Council Hortus of the Imperium Protectorate. Curse of Facium Illnatrium. With its power, the light can hide just as well as shadows. Hmm. Periscope and Protectorate report monitor log noted down by Amarillion of the Black Team. 1009. The Blues started installing the electrical and gas traps in the sewers. Wools, we installed our traps last week. The Silvers put in their gas bombs six days ago. Got to remember to avoid those doors, or at least open them from afar with a long pole. The Reds put in a falling candelabra in the cathedral. How original. What if it actually crushes someone to death? That would be funny, but I'm sure the Master of Medicine could revive him anyway, unless it broke the poor chap's spine in two. 1144. The white team were knocked out by the Gold's gas attack. These nightly games are turning out to be a lot calmer compared to the daytime war games of last year. Most of the team are behaving like cowards now, and are sitting ducks, camping out in their territory, afraid to make any moves. 1149. Sivan Shi, white team member number 7, was stripped naked and thrown off the bridge into the water. Ironically, he crushed Pontius, who was camping there on the ice. The Builder doth play tricks with fate and steed. Shivan stole Pontius as cloak the bastard. I truly hope he does not discover the light-bending properties of our cloaks, or we could all be in deep trouble. If he just happens to make it past the Silvers into the catacombs, we'll show him what we do with little thieves. 1152 Clavicus M, gold team member number 3, sneaked through the secret tunnels and jumped onto two blues in the sewers. His surprise attack is an interesting note, but he has no way to get past the blue team's electrical and gas traps now. 1227. Reported the log details to the team. Had a good laugh over the fate of poor Pontius. Concerned about Shivan C. Seems that he's actually using the shadows to his advantage. Who knew that knave could figure out the intricate systems of the light bending cloak? We'll have to take him out personally and take back what's ours. Verily, these are the findings thou didst most graciously request of thy humble servant. We believe that we are nearer unlocking the secrets of the parchments. Indeed, those of us that doth toil in silence and candlelight here amidst the dust daubed cloisters and hallowed silence of this most seemly institute of learning believe that we have made something of a breakthrough. We have discerned a name that we postulate may have its counterpart in our language as Nemesis. It is written that it shall come up amongst the Golden Ones to guard the Antipraxis in the days of the Severance when a forest of swords shall blind the Great One. The is described as a being possessed of one of the most human-like qualities known, displaying an emotional intensity, it is, for all that, the more abominable. Enjoying a dark relationship with something whose only semi-translatable feature is perceived to be leech. It is rumoured that the shadows have become involved in this matter, and if so, then this issue is surely more worrisome and more important than we had at first thought, or had been led to believe. They leave us no traitors, except those that doth inevitably lead in the opposite direction. With fragments speaking of shadows moving over the earth, fire with teeth, 
I'm consuming darkness that eats the way to this investigator, and which has power to bring the whole world to his knees. We doubt not that this is a deeply dangerous and disturbing matter. We do continue to study in thy name, though at times it seems we are accursed. Though we have attained the dark art of invisibility in the shadows, far too often either the light bending cloak fails, or its user simply lacks the required concentration. Do we but approach the altar of understanding, and one of us is posted elsewhere? Canst thou not assist us further, great leader? Even poor brother Rebinick did meet his death by falling from the clock tower, and he was known as our best translator. I wonder what he was doing up there. The altar of understanding. Oh, I think that's a metaphor. Uh, it shall come with amongst the golden ones to guard the Antipraxis in the days of the Severance, when the poet shall shall blind the Great One. I mean... Maybe that's talking about Garrett. Who knows? Maybe not. Alright, let's the T Black Team icon. We are now officially the winners of this game, but we have not yet finished with the mission. Alright, so they're gonna go down that passageway. No, they don't go down that passageway. They're gonna walk in front of that doorway, just barely visible, I think. Maybe they already have. Ah, there's the hole. I can wait. Oh yes. I can wait. I think he heard me. Where did he come from? No, oh, he's going back down the passage I came from, I think. crystals. Ball and lab equipment. Yeah, getting down there would have been possible, but not exactly safe. We needed a body to throw down first, I think. Okay. I mean, in the North Tombs, I don't think they've got anything else to offer, but we can probably get back that way. Well, we haven't done Poutine Purple. Right, 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 right. Weren't there supposed to be excavations? Beneath the library? this in the middle. It's mine now. Understand this statement with it the light can hide just as well as the shadows. Although, maybe if we hadn't put the torch out, maybe the black hand wouldn't be visible. It's my only guess. I don't see any other loot here. Bad 
I see. Well, there are people that patrol down this way, right? Are those traps? Those look like traps. Have I been running into traps before? I don't think I've run into any light shafts. People patrol down this way, right? Wait, this is looking east. Hang on. Where am I? Not where I thought it was. I'm in northwest now. Oh. Oh no. Okay, that's that's where I came from. So I'm in this room. I guess there are traps there. So the north tombs. Let's stay out of those light shafts. What? What are you doing? Somebody flickering there as well. That wasn't my doing. Is that the leader? I do see loot there. Well, these guys are making themselves visible. Maybe they're just flickering because there's a flickering light. Rather than their invisibility malfunctioning. I think I need to keep them all occupied. Didn't want that to go there. They didn't even react. That's interesting. So how am I going to get past these guys, or am I going to go all the long way around? Maybe I just go the long way around. It's funny, kind of funny that one of them tripped their own traps. That's, I find that pretty funny. These guys do not seem to be going the full length of the hallway, which means... the coverage of it is not going to let me through, right? So we're getting pretty close to the goal. I think by the time we've found out how to get into purple territory and looted it, we should be alright, I think. I guess I'm going to go the long way. It seems like it's not going to be possible. Otherwise. Now somebody did patrol this hallway, did they not? Yes, there they are. Wait, 
where'd they go? Okay, coming the right way. Where's this guy patrol? Because he comes around here and goes around to the outside, right? So I'm coming back. I guess not. I guess I saw him going through the second floor light or something. There he is. Hmm. Wait, two of them going opposite directions? Or two of them going the same direction? I didn't expect two of them here. No, two of them going in the same direction. Okay, they're both going away, they're both coming this way. That's, I guess that's fine. Yeah, they are, that's right, they were two. They're going to come through, and I think they're going to turn to their left. I'm not 100% sure, so I guess we'll wait and see. Wow. You know what? I'm going to end the episode here, on this cliffhanger.